have come to St Catherine's Castle um, so we thought we came from up there um, originally um, and we couldn't see whether you can see Paris um, so we really didn't want to come down we didn't think we'd actually get into the castle um, didn't realise you had to come down a path but this is a nice view I don't know if you can see, but there's a guy like standing right on that rock edge, fishing. Um, I know he's wearing a high boots, but I don't think that's really going to help him. <laughs> so yeah, it's a bit risky. So this is the name of the place if you are interested in coming. That building up there with a chapel. Um, 1909. So Michael, I think it was on the board back there. Look at these rocks. Chapel was two storey high. So I kind of fell asleep for a little bit after we were done doing Prince Castle. Um, and now Perry's taken me to this place which is surrounded by large like boulders and then this ladder to make your way up. So I'm going to have to put you guys down for a moment because otherwise um, yeah, I can't carry you. So this is one ladder up. These hand tools to grab hold of. There's not a lot up here. Uh, I've gone all the way over there, but that's a bit sketchy. Well, I'm coming up. So we've got to the top. So I've been. So this is called Roach Rock. And um, so it's spelled R O C H E, and it's in Bodmin. And um, but yeah, if you do come to this, you just need to make sure that you are very careful because there are ladders and it's quite bit of unsafe rock obviously you can just about see there's the first ladder the second ladder is what Perry's on down here at the moment and you can walk along there but there is a bit of a gap so if you do come to this area you just got to be very careful um, but this is in Mod Bodmin um, so you can see like here that was where the second floor was and then these are obviously the stairs up but it's all built in this rock place um, but this is like the view out um, Yeah, so I'm probably going to make my way out, way down now because he won't let me go over there and cross that. That one there. I really need to park that where he was though. So. Oh no, just for checking. So this is our little house. So we are staying at Waterside Cornwall and we have you can probably see a little bit behind me of these little triangle lodges. I've never stayed in anything like this before, um, but they look pretty cool. So this is ours. So we're staying in Lodge 10. Um, there is one behind us, which they must be like pay extra. Um, 
and it'd be like a obviously a little hot tub I don't think that would be open due to everything that's going on so this is our lodge <laughs> so we go through here oh the push not pull so this is one of the bathrooms so this is where the shower is very clean obviously due to everything at the moment hello perry's de hairing my brush <laughs> so then we go through into the living room dining kitchen area so we've got a nice tv there i think perry's what have you got if what have you attached to the back of the tv the google chromecast that you've been sort of there you go so we can watch some netflix or something on there um, then these are the little sofa, dining room area and obviously some people do stay here for quite a period of time so we do, I have noticed, there is a washing machine but we won't need to be using that facility and then we've got the dishwasher and then fridge already filled up and there is actually, which I wasn't expecting a freezer as well um so obviously if you need if you are staying for a couple of nights um and you've got bits like that and all the cupboards oven lovely view out there are some other little lodges as well so then we go upstairs to the master bedroom and the bathroom so this one is a one bed i don't know if there is probably more different sizes as well haven't looked in the bedroom yet so here we are very nice and we have a little balcony didn't even notice we have a little balcony out there are they both the both doors open or is it just the one it looks like the ones that are both but maybe not no. Well, it might be, you might be able to open both out. Oh, then he walked right into the door then. Oh, no. Oh. No, there's bottom one, don't go. The don't, don't. Opens. Don't break it. <laughs> um, so then through into the bathroom. Very nice. So there is on the paperwork downstairs at the moment the... Um, spa bit on here the bubbles aren't working which we was a bit excited about having having a bath with that but at the moment they have made them not work um, but it's a nice corner bath there needs to be a mirror here you got your, you got your oh your little yeah like a little desktop mirror yeah just a little like one on the side I don't know what's in here I'm gathering it's like cleaning bits Oh, here's your, so at the end, you have to put all your bedding in a black bag, um, so then they will take it off. So I found the, the bags for later on when we finish. So we're here Monday to Thursday. And then obviously the boiler. So yeah, so that is our little um, waterside lodge tour. Um, I think we're going to go for a little walk along around the like the campsite areas. Lucky the campsite. Campsite. I'm thinking of like. Yeah, around the site. Around the site. I don't know why I'm saying campsite. Um. So yeah, we're going to have a little walk around um, the site shortly once we just like finish unpacking everything, and then yeah, I'll show you around there. So obviously everything's closed at the moment, but they would have like a segway area. There is a um, and this is the main bit where the swimming pool and would have been um, like restaurant and stuff obviously with things closed at the moment um this isn't open so we're gonna go for a little walk you right have you seen something a hole in the road it does look a bit like a hole in the roof so yeah i think i'm gonna go Maybe for a little walk Maybe, who knows? So yeah, I'm gonna go for a little walk. 
So we found a tennis court. There is a code inside um, on the lodge. So if you do bring your own bits, you can access this. And then over there, which I'll walk over in a sec, there's a football golf as well. So yeah, here's a tennis court if you... Oh, there's meant to be a code. Obviously yeah, someone is. never yeah. locked it beforehand. So yeah, if you bring your tennis rackets, it's obviously they're not providing bits at the moment. Um, but yeah, over here, So if you have got a football, <coughs> have we got a football? We could have a game of football golf. Uh, I think I took it out for facing the boot. Uh, we can buy one. <laughs> so they have got a football golf area. You might be able to see a couple, maybe. A little bit of flag. Um, so yeah, we may have to get a football. So we can have a go, a go at this. But yeah, they have got a football golf. So we found where the outside seating would have been for like the restaurant and there's a little, a little lake that it overlooks and then we found the play area as well but it looks like a very, if you've done bottles, um, it looks like a very overgrown bold green it doesn't really look like a bolt screen in it. That's the word that's really not been used for a while. And it looks like I'm embarrassing if someone looks through to me in here. But I know this is well and truly not open. That would have been the pool. Yeah. If that was open. It's not as big as I thought it was going to be. It's better than nothing, man. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Just having a little... It feels like very abandoned because of not very much being open and there's no staff really here. It's kind of like yourself checking. But yeah, that's the pool. You can only see the reflection of me in the background. Going but yeah. Back, back the to the lodge. It mustn't be whole.